Hi there, I'm Lisa Doyle with J. Rockcliffe Realtors and welcome to East Bay Eats. So East Bay Eats is a wonderful way that we can support our local restaurants and I want to introduce you to one of my favorite places here in downtown Danville. We are here at Albatross in a quaint little charming restaurant and I can't wait for you to meet the owner and check out this restaurant. And of course, we started East Bay Eats a few years ago just so we could help support locally owned restaurants in our East Bay and boy, now more than ever, they need our help. So Albatross is not open officially yet, although we so hope that some of the patio restaurants get to open soon. But they are here for a full takeout. They have some of the most amazing food. And when Greg and I have come to Albatross, you know, prior to the shutdown this year, um, they have, the food is just amazing. The service is incredible. It's a charming, wonderful little quaint restaurant right here in the uh, downtown Danville. So I wanna take you in and introduce you to the owner. Um, show you some of their most popular dishes and hopefully you all get a chance to come you know come and um, support the local downtown restaurants and try them out you will be amazed so come on in I want to introduce you to Marasa come on in Of course, we are, um, you know, being mindful of today's requirements, and uh, Marasa and I are at a distance. <laughs> but this is Marasa. She's the wonderful owner of Albatross here in Danville. And of course, we're going to share, um, Marasa owns another restaurant here in our area too, which I want to share. But so Marasa, tell us a little bit about Albatross. Uh, how long have you guys been here? Thank you, Lisa. Yeah. And thanks for everyone who's listening. Uh, Albatross, we have been here very new. Uh, so, um, this uh, restaurant has been founded two years ago and construction took a while for me, but we are open for a year. Our motto and mission statement over here is the quality over quantity for sure. Yeah. We wanted to come up with today's good ingredient, good farmers that we know, and uh, create simple dishes, but we want you guys to taste and see what fresh produce can create. Oh, it's amazing. We, when we've come here, the one thing that Greg and I have always walked out saying is, oh my God, the food just tastes amazing. Thank and your you. service is so uh, like genuine and kind and such um, attentive service. It made us feel like we were, you know, just a special. You Thank know? you. Yeah. It's all because of the team yeah. stuff. The team is very young, motivated, genuine people that they love to create. Yeah. They're really starving for creation. Yeah and uh, it's just and it's not a rocket science it's food it's a universal language that you could transfer love to other people yeah. so um we are so proud to be here and we definitely trying our very best to survive at this uh, economy yeah. and hopefully everything becomes very rare and we could just continue serving you guys well we want to keep everyone safe of course but hopefully we get to open up at least your patio sometime soon uh, but you guys so. are doing full takeout which is wonderful yes. um, so what I want to do is I want to introduce them to one of your favorite or one of your most popular dishes um, and then of course um, I encourage all of you come down check out Albatross uh, mm -hmm. you won't regret it absolutely and we want to support the locals we want to help thank you and what Marasa does too like she was sharing she's supporting all of the local farmers all of the everything is fresh everything's purchased local yes um, yes you know it's I just want to add something on this again it's not at this time I believe all of our businesses it's no longer about profitability yeah. any anyway of course our, our mission was never only profitability and it was social uh, responsibility as well mm -hmm. but at this time more than ever we are bound by that so yeah. we are again we are we, um, we uh, reach out to our vendors and see how we can help you you were helping us your small businesses how we can help you yeah. they put a package together instead of you go to the supermarket stay in a line and try to buy what you need you go online and see the produce packages meat packages chicken packages seafood packages if you see it fit, it's no profit for us at all. We are setting it for them. You order it online, you pay online, you stay outside, we bring it to your car. Yeah. So this way they could stay alive, we could support them, hopefully we could continue at the end as well. Yeah. Well, and it's the same with us, you know, all of us need to rally together, which is what I hope that they come out and 
you know, and, and uh, come out and order some food here. You know, have some takeout, enjoy it. Um, so let's go back in the kitchen and let's meet the chef real quick and then you can show us one of your most popular dishes. So here we are, we are at the back of the kitchen here at um, Albatross and I'm with the main chef, his name is Angel. And so Angel, um, tell us how long have you worked here? I've worked here for about a year, right okay. after they started last April. Um, yeah, it's been awesome. I awesome, love it yeah. here so much. One of my favorite places, so. Mine too. I love yeah, it. and the food here is amazing. So what Angel's going to do is you're going to show us a little of your, what's one of your common dishes, right? Yes. Our most popular dishes. Absolutely. Yeah, so here we have an olive oil mashed potato. Okay. And I'm going to be plating it with our uh, half roasted chicken. Uh, every single day we throw it on the rotisserie with uh, lots of fresh herbs. And we just do whatever really is in season. So right here I have some... Uh, grilled broccolini. Oh my gosh, that looks great. Yeah, it has some Aleppo peppers on it, so you get a little bit of spice. Just throw this guy right in there. And that then here we have a salsa verde. Oh my gosh. And all a little... The, all, sorry to interrupt. All the oh, flavors no. here are really good too. I don't know if you guys are using like... Um, because you're, everything is so fresh, maybe it's because the spices are fresh, it's just the flavor is always very good. Yes, we try to keep everything as fresh as possible. Yeah. Go to the farmer's market, keep in touch with all the purveyors, and really just see what's in season and what's fresh. Beautiful, so what's this Thank called you. when you order it? This is our half rotisserie chicken okay. with herbs de Provence. Awesome. Yes. Looks amazing. Salsa verde. Thank as, you. And as we were sitting here, there's something up on the counter too I wanted to, um, I think I've even had this here when I've had food when I've here before. What is that? That is a uh, turmeric roasted cauliflower okay. with golden raisins and a little bit of uh, fresh dill. So you, and then you guys have, obviously during takeout, um, some of the menu's been um, adjusted a bit, right? Yes. So you guys, what's the, you're, but you're basically offering a pretty full ability for menu, right? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. So we have about a quarter of our menu is take and bake. So we have, you know, some things you could throw in the oven. Lasagnas, we have meatloaf, um, really, really good enchiladas, uh, chicken alfredo. We also have a really good carrot cake right now. Oh, man. We just take and defrost. Keep it convenient, really easy for the people just to take home and not have to worry about making dinner every night. Well, you, you know what I've loved about coming to Albatross is uh, some of the restaurants that, are, that you would consider to be fine dining are very... Um, adult friendly but not kid friendly. Yes. You guys have dishes that are great for kids too. Absolutely. Like the lasagnas and things and all the all the wonderful food that kids enjoy too. So there's just a wonderful place you can bring kids and hopefully once we're back open, you know, people will be able to do that. Yes. Um, but in the meantime, the takeout here is amazing. Absolutely. Yeah. I appreciate that. So yeah, you guys, so thank you so much everyone for watching. Um, this is again Angel. He is the main chef here at Albatross in Danville. And we are of course the 2020 version of uh, East Bay Eats. We hope you guys come here, enjoy this place. Once we reopen our area, you know, come enjoy the dining here. But takeout's amazing. Check them out. Um, and the owner of this, uh, her name is Marasa. They also own Primavera in San Ramon. That is also available for takeout. Amazing food. Try them both out. Come out, do some takeout, and pass this on to everyone you know. Thanks so much for watching. Take care. So thank you everyone for tuning in. Please share this with all of your friends. Share this post, tell the people that you know, get the word out, come down to Albatross, look at supporting all the local um, restaurants here in our East Bay. But come check out Albatross, you absolutely won't regret it. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Lisa Doyle and I hope to see you soon. Take care.